What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video. And we're putting out a video series of all the players that are contenders at the French Open going through their likely road to the final and to the title for RG. We're going to start with the world number one. Novak Djokovic, this is what his projected road to the final and to the title is going to be for 2021. So his first round opponent is locked in. He's playing tennis Sangren in the first round. He actually has a 3-0 head-to-head -head record against Sangren, but they have never played on a clay court. So you would expect that Djokovic, he's going to get through that match. His second round opponent, is most likely going to be Luca Puy, the Frenchman. And Djokovic also has a 3-0 head-to-head record against Puy. So again, you would expect that Djokovic is going to get through that one. His third round opponent is projected to be the number 29 seed and Frenchman, Hugo Wombert. And these two have only played the one time with Djokovic getting the straight sets win at Wimbledon two years ago. So you'd expect again Djokovic to get through that match on experience. In his fourth round, there are two potential opponents. The 13th seed, David Golfan, is the highest seed in this part of the draw along with Djokovic. But Djokovic has a 7-1 record over Goffin. So if they do meet in the fourth round, Djokovic will be loving that matchup. And the other opponent he could potentially play is the 21st seed, Dimonor. Now, these two have never played. So out of the two potential fourth round opponents being either Goffin or Dimonor, he'd definitely rather face Dimonor, a guy that he's never played before. Going on to the quarterfinals now, there are two big names that Djokovic is likely to face in the quarterfinals. First one, Roger Federer, the number eight seed in this tournament. And these two have played a lot of times before, 50 times, in fact, with Djokovic leading the head-to-head 27-23 but I think the lack of match play for Federer over the last couple of years heavily favors Djokovic if they do meet in that quarterfinal but the more likely scenario is that Djokovic is going to have to play the number nine seed Matteo Berrettini who has been very good on the clay in 2021 these two have only played the one time back in 2019 at the Nido finals with Djokovic winning in straight sets so, so if Djokovic has to face Federer or Berrettini he'll be feeling good about his chances of making the semi-finals onto the semi-finals now and that's when things get serious Nadal he'll be waiting in the semi-finals, maybe Rublev as well, but most likely Rafa and Djokovic just lost to Rafa a couple of weeks ago in Rome on the clay courts. He does have a winning head-to-head -head record against Rafa, but it's 29-28, so that gap's slowly closing. But if he does play against Rublev, he'll be feeling a hell of a lot better because Djokovic and Rublev have never played before, and Rublev is probably going to have to beat Nadal to get to the semi-finals, which is a big win in itself, and then play Novak the next day. You'd expect Djokovic to beat Rublev, and then onto the final. There are three most likely scenarios happening for Djokovic if he does make the final. He's probably going to be either facing Tsitsipas, Dominic Team, or Alexander Zverev. Now, he has a 5-2 record against the final Tsitsipas, and the two did play at the French Open last year in the semifinals, and it went five sets. So it's going to be an epic match if they do play in that final, because the clay courts, if Team was to make the final and Djokovic was to play Team, it's a 7-5 record in favor of Djokovic, with Djokovic leading 4-3 on clay courts. Dominic Team did win the last one, though. And that was at the French Open semi-finals two years ago, and it was a five-set epic. If Djokovic was to play Zverev, however, he has a 6-2 record over Sasha Zverev, having won their last five meetings, including their last one on clay in straight sets at this French Open in 2019. So if Djokovic could pick who he wants to play in the final out of those three, he's probably going to want to pick Zverev. So there you have it. They are all the scenarios for Novak Djokovic. Potentially, of course, these are just projected. It could be, there could be upsets. There could be anybody making it into the semifinals, quarterfinals, final, but they are the most likely opponents for Novak Djokovic going into the French Open and going to win the title. He's going to have to beat a lot of those names. Let me know down in the comments below, how far will he go? Can he make it past Rafa in the semifinals? Or will he only make it to the semifinals? Maybe even the quarterfinals. Berrettini, Federer, they're going to be looming large in that quarterfinal potentially as well. The Novak Djokovic, he's got a pretty tough road to the final after the first week.